Hey friends, October weddings are some of my favorites because the weather is so nice. And also Halloween is right around the corner. So today I want to make a Halloween themed wedding cake. Hey, Joshua. Yo. Sorry to interrupt. What happened to that bat we caught in the studio? Dude, I caught that thing in a mason jar and let it go, but it bit me. Heard like a son of a... I want everything in this cake to be monochromatic red inside and out. So I'm gonna make a cherry filling and I'm going to fold into my buttercream to make it red. We're gonna start with cherries. Did you eat some of the cherries? Do I have some things on my face? Just a little bit. A little bit. Sugar. We're gonna do some zest and some juice. We're gonna let this boil down for about 15 to 20 minutes. Joshua, did you uh, did you go clothes shopping recently? I decided to like up my wardrobe a little bit. What do you guys think? I got this from The Gap. Uh, the Gap? Yeah. Okay, cool. That looks good, man. Hey, Thanks. Carry on. This recipe doesn't by chance call for garlic, does it? I hate garlic. I just woke up and I was like, ah, garlic is awful. I hate it. I don't really like asparagus either. Grass. While that's melting, I'm gonna add cornstarch. You can't add cornstarch to boiling liquid because it will lump. So we're gonna make a slurry by adding a little bit of water. My uncle Jimmy's always kind of slurry. I'm like, have you been hitting the cornstarch and water again? Guys, you don't tell me how much cornstarch to have. And then we're gonna add some vanilla as well. There is a measurement in the recipe down there or at you've been deserted.com. I'm a rebel, right? With my new clothes. It looks a little bit like blood. <gasps> Yuck, no way. Now, if you let this cool, this is just like cherry pie filling. We're gonna burr mix it with a hand blender to get all the cherries busted up. Then we're gonna cool it and then fold it into our buttercream. Where'd my burr mixer go? I swear to God, I will bite someone's neck off. It looks delicious. Is that blood? Dr. Acula's cherry filling, it's definitely not blood. Made with real cherries, and it's not even blood. 100% organic, and it's totally not blood. It's not blood. It's not. It's cherry filling. Dr. Acula's cherry filling, it's definitely not blood. So stop asking. <laughs> We're gonna add some of our cool cherry filling into some Swiss meringue buttercream, and then I'm gonna add a little bit of red food coloring to really make the color pop. Is that blood? No, it's not blood, jeez. It got all coagulated. I know, <laughs> I mean, gross. <laughs> I hate it, I hate it so much. Okay, we're gonna add a little bit of red and a little bit of burgundy food coloring. I don't really know what color blood is. I've never really seen it, I haven't seen it much, so I'm just guessing here. Just a random question, Joshua. Yeah. What would you say Kristen Stewart's best movie or series of movies were? <laughs> Twilight, of course. Brandon, it's getting worse. I know, because those movies were awful. Now we're gonna fill it a red velvet cake. I love that color, red's my favorite color. Okay, we're gonna break down an oval cake. I'm gonna cut the domes off and then slice them in the middle. It's a more violent way to describe cake cutting, I feel like. Well, you just wanna like slash them with the cake slayer. Pretty innocent. Ooh, that looks so pretty. Hey, JJR, I thought it was a little bit strange that you made the call time at midnight. What's I've that all about? Been, like, I've been really tired during the day. It's just bright out. Sun hurts my eyes sometimes, that's all. Is that a big deal, Brandon? Don't be such a pain in the neck. Do you know what song's in my head and I can't get it out? Red, red wine, stay close to- Cause we're doing all this red. Is that the one by Millie Vanilli? No, it's the knockoff, Miller Vanilla. Remember them? Or were they the original? Alrighty, I'm gonna get this guy in the cooler, trim the sides, crumb coat, final coat. Get ready for fondant. Oh, 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 oh. That's a weird laugh, huh? My cake is freshly covered in fondant, and now I'm gonna hand cut some texture. This is kind of like exaggerated alligator skin. Once I'm done though, it'll kind of look creepy and like brain-like. Hey Joshua. Yo. You wanna hear some viewer comments yes. uh, while you work? Let's do it. Viewer comment. It's Halloween time, so it's time for mean viewer comments. Let's do it. Hey, you guys who love us, just like protect us, that's all. All right, I'm not gonna say any of the names of these people. We'll blur them out, but we'll leave their icons, their avatars. Say their names. I don't wanna give them shine, because then other people will do it. That's true. All right, uh, this first one just says, LOL, get over yourself. <laughs> no way. People in front of the camera never get over themselves. This other dork said, Yeah. Ugh, these shorts are the worst. Please stick this stuff on another channel. Get with the times, okay? I film it with my iPad. It's funny. It's cute. If you don't like it, get off YouTube shorts. Go watch the episode. Done. Yeah, and now we're going to call you Grandpa Dork. <laughs> yeah. This next ding dong said, The guy in the back is so 
annoying. I can't finish the video. Okay, sometimes. No, I'm kidding. I don't think it's very cool of him to talk about Brandon like that. <laughs> oh, burn. Last but not least, this piece of work on the making allergy friendly cookies for YouTube shorts video. Okay. Said, basically you bought fake weird alternatives to all the good actual stuff. No. There are perfectly good ways to make delicious baked goods that are allergy friendly without needing to get substitutes for eggs, butter, and flour. Jeez, this is such a pet peeve of mine. But to our fans' credit, someone responded. Somebody stuck up for us. You guys always do this and I love it so much. L. Grunewald, I'll say her name. Hi, buddy. Thank you. What'd she do? What'd she do? Tell she me. She said, those ingredients are all in the top eight allergens, so those cookies wouldn't be allergy free. To which the original Ding Dong said, sorry, that wasn't clear. However, the video's called Making Allergy Friendly <laughs> Cookies. How is it not clear, Ding Dong? I won't ever really respond to negative. It happens. I mean, it's just part of being on the internet. We put ourselves out there, obviously. We, we want following, we want people, we want to do this full time. We know we're going to get it. And we do read every comment. If you like this, if you like us reading our mean tweets, uh, let us know. We'll do it again. I also want to say our fans are super nice. Plus, we pay for this show. I pawned all all my baseball cards growing up <laughs> just so we could buy this stupid camera. So uh, yeah, the negative comments, they sting a little bit, you know? I really want this cake to say I love you in the most Halloween way ever. So I'm gonna put hearts on the cake, but like actual hearts. <laughs> <laughs> Why not, you know? It still says love. It's still a heart. Goopy poopy chocolate. Settle in there, settle in there, heart. Eat your heart out. All right, I'm gonna get these in the cooler to firm up completely, and then we're gonna glaze them with a little bit of fake blood so they look real. I think that's gross, though. I don't like that at all. Mm. Oh my God, this is so, oh, are we ready? Is that blood? This is glazed blood. Hmm. So it gets makes them like juicy, but then they look a little bit more realistic. And when we put them on the cake, we'll do like a drip and then we'll set them on there so it looks like they're dripping. That blood looks pretty realistic. Are you sure it's not real blood? It's not real blood, I promise. Let me taste it. No. Yeah, like super delit, I mean, super gross. This part is gonna be so much fun because we're gonna take all of our sugar flowers and lace and airbrush everything red. It's like a blood bath, but I hate blood. Is this gonna get all over me? I hope so. No. I'm gonna keep it like this. I'm not gonna clean it out and let it get all splattery. It'll look like blood splattery. All right, now it is time to stack our cakes together. Do you wanna use this wooden steak doll I made? Yeah. What's that all about? I don't know. Fire. Dude, those are totally bad for the environment. We're gonna use eco-friendly paper straws. Okay, I'm gonna insert one in the middle, mark it, and then mark all the other ones the same. Driving things into things. I'm feeling triggered. Like if I were to drive a stake into your heart? Ah, no. Why would you do that, Brandon? Look, Joshua, I just gotta ask, are you a vampire? Huh? You, you, you do all the things. It's obvious. You're a vampire, huh? You turn into a vampire at some point. I'm not a vampire. You dress in weird. Your eyes look all messed up. You got blood on your lips. I, this is cherry juice. I really just wanted to try a new thing with my look. I don't know. My bed kind of looks like a coffin, but it's not a coffin. It closes, but it's cozy. Now I'm going to grab all of my decorations and we're going to make this bad boy come to life. Hey, can I ask you a question? Sure. Uh, now that we know that you're a vampire, can you just promise not to bite us? I would never bite you guys. I'm not a vampire though. Yeah, juicy cake. You can hear the comments now. That's a wedding cake? Oh, everyone's mouth's gonna be red. I think this is the perfect Halloween wedding cake. 
delicious cherry filling, red velvet cake, absolutely no blood. If you want Dr. Acula's cherry filling, I'll put it down below or it's on the website, you've been deserted. Com. Hit subscribe. I hope you guys are having the most fantastic Halloween season. I'm Joshua John Russell, and you've been deserted. Okay, Joshua. Yo. Now the show's over, you can be honest. Yeah. Are you a vampire? I'll never tell. <laughs> James, James, there's a bird in the house. There's a there's a freaking bird in the house. <laughs> they have to clean this up. Bye. <laughs>